real joy for us because you know it's the end, the end result is you want to see kids do well and move on and uh, you know his time here is done and, and we're excited. I mean Boston's a great place. Coach Adazio, phenomenal coach. He's going to bring that program back and, uh, and there's no doubt in my mind and uh, just excited for him to have the opportunity to play teams like USC and uh, Virginia Tech, Florida State, Clemson. Uh, so I think it'd be a great challenge for him as a young man. You know, he's ready for that next journey. Really, he's morals. He teaches me more off the field than I am on the field. And that's just great. He's going to go with me all throughout my career and all through college and all throughout my life. So honestly, without those morals, who knows where I'd end up being today. So I think that's what, one of the best things he's taught me. After, after we faxed out the, the official scholarship this morning we talked and uh, you know, I think he's got to get bigger he's got to get stronger we want uh, I want more flexibility uh, you know what he's done here is just uh, like I said it's fast we don't look behind us we're gonna look forward uh, the linebackers the next level gonna be bigger stronger faster so is the D line so is the O line so uh, he's gonna start all over again he's got to start from square one and, and just work ethic uh, he'll he'll use the contact and intensity he learned here and uh, we're looking forward to being to him having a great career. When I went up there for my visit, I gelled with him great. Like all the guys, I talked to him, we had good bonds. And I was only there for two days, so imagine how that's going to be in four years. So that was great. And on top of that, like mentally, I think I can come in and learn the offense as fast as I can. And we'll see how, where it goes from there. Let the physicality take over. Things is when you go to college campus, uh, you have to have your own time management. You have to discipline yourself, and uh, he, he's going to be a low maintenance kid. What they refer to as low maintenance, he's going to take care of himself, and and that's a plus for any coaching staff, even at the high school level. And I think that he's going to run with, he's going to set his goals high, and, and he'll achieve them just like he did this year. He's going to achieve them, and and uh, I think sky's the limit.